Hello there, and welcome back to some more Banjo 2. In the last episode, we started exploring the ice side of the Hailfire Peaks, and now we're going to explore the rest of it. Including this little bit. Hello. Chilly Willy. Cold and icy dragon. Uh, you must be the pizza delivery boy that beat my, my poor brother. He tried to eat us. I suppose you'll be wanting pizza too? Yes, please. I ordered an anchovy deluxe. Well, tough. We've got none. I'm sure you have. Give me my pizza. times if I aim it well. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll do is not panic now. Bye. Stop it, I don't want pizza anymore. I'll go and get a takeout instead. Hold on, you frosty fool. We've beaten both of you now, so I reckon we should get a trophy. Trophy, eh? How about this? Which way is it to the fly through the book jiggies? That wasn't so bad. You just have to avoid the fast firing bullets, which is a bit scary, but not too difficult. Right. Okay, so let's go. So now I won't be accosted by anyone anymore, so I can explore at my leisure, which is exactly what I want to do. Right, how do I get... Shit. I'm definitely dead, right? No, not dead, because I can slide down the mountain. Right. Next on the agenda is how do I get the snowball to where I want it to be? Namely, at the top of this ledge. It has to get to where it needs to go with enough health to still be relevant. Right, so there's a way through there. Right, okay, hang on. So, if there's a way through there, and I can roll around through here. So I've got to find the path that goes from here to the next way to get to Ice World. That the snowball can also get to. That's the hard part. The snowball has to also be able to get there. That's the bad one. I don't know why those two are so closely put together. If there's a little bit of snow on the top that I can use to heal back up. Mm -hmm. Right, run away, run away, run away. That's the only bad one, really. Okay, quick. Okay, I made it out. 
No, don't do that. You fall back out there, you'll die, Joey, you'll die. No. Okay. I just want to roll on the snow that's in the doorway over and over again. To get bigger. See if there's anything worth digging up down there. It's an oil derrick. I gather I have to go in that hole in the pipe. Oh. Oh. Only not a big snowball. This gap actually looks quite large. I was wondering how I'd make it happen, but it's actually quite big. save the aliens. How do we do that? Easy. So simple a child can understand it. Back off, right. Let's go get Kazooie back. Uh-huh. Right, then we go over to the, the, the warp pad, and we warp up to the Icicle Grotto, and then we jump up there with Kazooie, and then we glide over to the platform, which I accidentally did before. Also, the pigs are full of shit, by the way. That the hot water is too hot, because the whole point of what it would cool down if you put it in normal water. Eventually, it would cool off. I guess they just want it immediately. I gotta do this series of shitty jumps again. glide. I'll test if I can fly up or not. I don't think so though. No, you can just cancel it. Cool, a little alien baby. Mummy? Don't look at me, kid. This is so called mummy. Daddy, me no like cold earthling planet. Me nice and toasty now. Time to go home. Happy to help. Weirdo. Let's have a quick search around the perimeter for anything I could have missed. 
which is a lot. Banjo, come back to me. I always mistime that. I always go way early. I think things are going to be faster than they are. That time it was okay though. Whoa. <laughs> Nearly flew off the planet, but besides that. Lower zone, please. Now I need to get Mumbo back here to heal the other alien baby. It did work. I hope this works. Life force and the alien child. Thank you, Earthlings, not all brain dead. You have done well, Earthling, but I shall now have to exterminate you all for taking so long. Uh, have your kids seen my laser anywhere? Ah, uh, it must be on the ship. Your race is spared for now, Earthling. Stand clear, beaming up sequence initiating. Seventy-three. That should be everything in this area, besides the Jinjo. Yeah, Jinjo and a honeycomb section, which we'll come back for later. Don't worry, Mumbo. I'm, I'm leaving, Humbo. I'm leaving. I'm not here to, you know, grind any gears. Oh, I know where the Jinjo is. It's through the water. The Jinjo's through the water. Um, as for the honeycomb piece, I'm not entirely sure. Oh, shit! I got this, don't worry. I have a thinking, a thinking man solution to the waterfall problem. I couldn't go through his the bag, but maybe I can shoot a clockwork egg through it. I never tried that. I could do this without taking any damage at all, but where's the fun in that? Let's see if I can shoot a normal leg through it first. I can, so this is almost definitely what I gotta do. What? Okay, that's not what I gotta do. Old school solutions to modern problems. Oh, <laughs> 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 
This level completely done. Yep. Grunty needs two jiggies still. But I know where to get one of them now. Pterodactyl Land needs one jiggy, but I can't do that yet. Even though you fell like 12 years. A year isn't a measure of distance, but it's fine. Right, so. The other hags. What's missing here? It's just jiggies, right? Yeah. Which I think are the three other Jinjo Jiggies. Yeah. Makes sense. So now we go to Wasteland. Because that's where the other entrance is. A level that we've never even seen. No other mention of it in other levels. Nothing. That happens with the yellow flashing. Emulator th just emulator things. Welcome to Cloud Cuckoo Land. The frame rate really suffers here. Like, very badly. I found a strange looking seed. Is it edible? Probably not. Got this before. Cool. I'm dead. This is a level where if you fall off, you just die. I fell back to the island. That's how far I fell. I, 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 that's how far I fell. There's no way you're taking me back to the fucking train station. Good. I was going to say, there's, there is no way. Fancy a little physical exercise, Fabol? Not really. Yes, you do, Banjo. Right, I'm Mr. Fit and I'm really fit. I am so fit, in fact, that if you can beat me in three events, I'll give you my fitness gold medal. That's nice. It is, actually. You can, you can probably see, event one is a high jump. The bar's set at my best height. All you need to do is jump over it to win. Jump over it. Oh, okay, well, I know what to do for that. Hang on. No, shit! No, 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 Okay, I know what to do. So, get ourselves the springy shoes. Get sucked up by the plant. Don't jump. Frame rate's hitting like single digits. How did you do that? Oh, never mind. We'll move on to event two when you find me. 
doesn't really matter that it goes all yellow, it's just weird. So it's gone into a sack. Okay, let's explore the whole outside of this area while we can. Don't want to go anywhere inside yet. I'm trying not to fall off the mountain this time. Joey, you dumb bitch. Looks almost like a love heart. It's a way to land. It's also squishy. Mm. The flower of shooting us. Oh, you're an angry flower, okay. Hi, right, Canary Mary, how you doing? Hey, Banjo, it's that crazy Canary Woman again. That's me! Now how about another ace? But the handcart's still down in the mine. Don't worry, you can use this clockwork mouse I found instead. Clockwork mouse, are you mad? Oh yes, go on, jump aboard and press aid as fast as you can to power the mouse along. This one's fucking hard, if I remember. Like, really, really hard. But we'll give it a good old go. Ready? Three, two, one, go! I will never be stopped. You beat me again! Yep, the usual prize will suffice. Don't be greedy, Kazooie. We win all her possessions in the mine. Oh no, you didn't look what I found up here. I also found another papery thing. Hop on the mouse if you want to try and win it. Oh, I do. Here we go. Crack the old fingers. We can do this. Let's do this. Finger pressing master. Ready? Three, two, one, go! I will not be beaten by a fucking canary. Around the bin. Through the handle. Love it. I cannot be stopped. I'm the master of button mashing. Keep going. It's an endurance, not a sprint. Get shit on. You heard. Did I lose? Sure did, lady. Now hand over that papery thing. My last possession. Well, that's it then. I reckon I'll be off for my dinner. What are you having? A nice warm sandwich and a tasty bag of millet. Mmm, sounds good. How about a third race to let us try and win your dinner? Well, no. you probably win and then I'd go hungry. See you around, fellow bird and bear buddy. Hey, hey, hey. 
just feels nice to rob an old lady of all her possessions. You know what I mean? Wait, where's the Globo going to be, do you think? Not around. Not around here. Now I've got to stretch my hands out. Hang on. Button mashing like that can hurt after a while if you don't look after yourself. So you've got to stretch your arms and hands out. There we go. Right. In the pan. Sploosh. Okay, we're back here. It was already down here, so let's go down. There's a globe over here, it sounds like. Hey, young man, I'm George Ice Cube, stuck up here at this perilous altitude. What happened, George? I was out walking on the icy side of Hellfire Peaks with my wife, Mildred, when a huge blizzard came along and blew me away. Why not stay up here? Lovely view. I'm afraid of heights now. I reckon I'm above the icy side, so if you could just give it a little push. That was a slight miscalculation. No, wrong side! Tell Mildred I love her. Sorry, buddy. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, that's not working. Just smacking it isn't the solution. Who thought? There he is. Now, I don't know if there's Humba Wumba's Globo or, Mim or Mumbo's Globo, but we'll, we'll take it. We'll just wait until we have two and then it'll be fine. Okay, so I think the only way to go from here is in the cave. Unless I can get back up here, which I think I can. Oh. 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 Okay, I need to get here, it's just Banjo. You got it. Let's go underneath here and try and find a split pad to do just that. I saw you, Note. I don't think I can see you, I did see you. Thank you. She who mends carts can also fix mice. Two-dimensional sausage monsters. You know, the usual. There's a path over there. What's out here? Something good, I'll bet. Skull. Okay. I was kind of hoping that it would just be the way back to the mainland, but. Actually, you know, I mean, I can just fly around now if I want. Hi, Mumbo. So there's a blue Mumbo skull and a red Mumbo skull. And I don't know why. Not interested. Now we've got the ability of flight. Let's go around the whole of the outside of the mountain. 
that's the entrance. I mean, the fact I can go around without the super lag flowers is actually a good thing. Someone's in the air! Defend your jiggy at all costs! Let's go in this bin. Okay, just Kazooie can open that. Owie! around the outside of the bin. More feathers. Good. I like feathers. A small banjo hole. And a way out again. Or does this shoot me? Spoosh. Ah, it's a red mumbo. Okay. I mean, we might as well look inside red mumbo and see what's going on. It does confuse me slightly. So that one's just straight up real. Okay. So now there's a downwards bouncy castle bit and a sack race where the rat went that we've got to go and well the ant eat or something i don't know what kind of animal it is and then we'll go over there this looks promising It's definitely a thing you lay on. That makes sense. It's a big egg. Why does that shoot me? Somewhere else, I guess. All right, back on the back to the flying. We got places to go. Here we are. Oh, there you are, Furball. Event 2 is the sack race. Find a sack from somewhere and race me to the finish line. Oh, I see. Okay. I mean, I'm stuck here now. How am I going to get down? Like this. Okay. <laughs> Great, that's a seed in the ground, but how's that help me? It's gonna shoot me up again. But I wanna go down, not up. Oh no, over here. Good. Good. Alright, so I need to find a split pad then. But I'd also like to go to the bouncy castle and see what's going on over there. That was just a misclick. I was already off the ground. Right. Bouncy Castle is downwards somewhere. Okay. It's also Money Zone. Pack off. I need to get in there somehow. I think I'm done. I got three. Yeah, okay. Good. That's nice. Now, where does this shoot me? There's Bouncy Castle, fun. Transport me. Sploosh. Me over here. 
somewhere else I've never been. Opens the money hole. So now I've got, got 20 seconds to get over there. Okay. How the hell am I going to do that? I just have to know where to go, I guess. I'm not going to worry about it too hard. Here's a good split pad. And a walk, too. This is somewhere I've already been, isn't it? This is it's a blue skull. It does. One of these days that's gonna give me health, but not today. Right down to Bouncy Castle fun times. Let's see if there's anything down here I'm interested in. Uh -huh. be a way in. Oh, there is a way in. It's got to be small. Okay. So does this shoot me off? Up here. That's interesting. Where does this go? Through a dangerous section, but if I do this, I should be good. Everything seems in order. Damn it. I was trying to get to the split pads, but I can get back there now. It doesn't matter. There should be a walk to the entrance and exit, so I should just use that. There we go. Central cabin, please. Okay, so now the rest of the level is going to be me running around and exploring as everyone else. Solo. I'll try and see what this sign says. Where's a Globo? Have you looked in this pool yet? See you guys next time when we explore Cloud Cuckoo Land properly and see what's going on. Goodbye.